Here we are down at Coventry Welsh after yet another great game uh, this season. Um, Bees came off 37-14 winners um, in what was a very feisty um, competition. But um, but yeah, it was um, ebbs and flow throughout the game and we uh, managed to grind it out and stick it when we needed to and then uh, score some nice tries as well. Yeah, we, we I think, uh, put that game to bed in the first half, really, which was... Uh, Playing the style of rugby that we aiming that know that these lads can play. I mean, uh, James had uh, made some tweaks uh, with some structure in midweek, and the boys really did put the uh, opponents to task in that first half. They were a strong side coming into this game uh, on a seven and one uh, record, uh, third only on. Um, points difference and it was always going to be a tough game but that first half I don't think they knew what to hit them and we moved that ball wide um, tired their big men out um, and in the second half it was a bit more of an arm wrestle they 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 restructured themselves and made it a hard work for us yeah. but that was probably a fantastic follow-on from what was a really good game last week um, and we just couldn't can see that we can only just build from that 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 was just just stunning stunning yeah no it really was and it's been great to see that development throughout the season now from those first two games where we weren't exactly sure where we were at yeah to get to this point now when we can kind of look back on a game and go so you know you can see it was more positive throughout than being on our back foot and stuff yeah coming into this league this season was always going to be a trial um we're playing about uh, against some very uh, well-organised teams um, and I think in the beginning of the season we were caught out a little bit um, and and didn't really play to our to our uh, best abilities but we're now finding our feet finding the pace of the league um, and hopefully uh, we will be competitive for the rest of the season and, and uh, people will be hopefully taking us very seriously after those first two games yeah yeah really hope so um, the, we're climbing up the table and balancing out those uh, score lines from the first ones and stuff now so yeah. it's uh, starting to see what the order will be and kind of who we our real competition is yeah I mean look we we just got to keep on focusing on our on our game plan um, we've got lads who can jump in at short notice as they did today thank, due to some illness overnight from key players but it didn't really change the way we played. Um, and as a result, uh, we've come off with a, a real comprehensive result today. Um, and uh, I couldn't be proud of the lads. Yeah, no, it was a really great day. Mm. And we've got it all to look forward to, is it in two weeks? Or... Uh, we'll so ne no, next week we've got your Toxter. Okay, okay. uh, and then that's at home, and then we're away again. Um, but, you know, we just got to put our hard work in the week. Uh, these lads uh, uh, are, are, you know, making time to come and uh, come to training, listen to the coaching staff, listen to the plans, the structure that we want to play, and e e executing it really, really well. Yeah, no, it's been yeah, really great, yeah. and we can't wait to see it continue next time out. Brilliant, thanks, Lou. Cheers.